Hello world, this is Curtis Potter with Boundless Inspiration. Yes, you heard that right. <laughs> She's ready to keep running. Um, boundless Inspiration. No longer Boundless Motivation. And see, the thing that caused me to do that was I heard a sermon by our pastor Ethan um, not too long ago. And the basis of his... Uh, sermon was the difference between motivation and inspiration and see he said that motivation only lasts for so long you know you can wake up in the morning and get motivated and work your butt off for three four hours and then bam some hits you like lunch that food gets in your belly and you're like you know i'm just gonna take it easy the rest of the day but if you're inspired it can last for life as long as you keep remembering your why and what inspired you and that made me think, I was like, man, you know, it was kind of like a, like a knife in the, in the gut because I was like, man, my speaking platform is boundless motivation. And I was always like, man, I felt great because I, I wanted to motivate people into becoming the best version of themselves along that journey with me. But I realized if I didn't inspire them at that moment in that sermon, I was like, you know what, maybe it's time to rebrand my name and i ask you that is it time to rebrand your name see in high school um my best friend at the time came in one day and was like what's up kpp and i was like what is that see i don't have a middle name it's just curtis potter jr and he said kpp is curtis piehead potter so your new nickname is piehead and i was like at the time i was like well, that's pretty accurate <laughs> i lived and died to smoke weed pretty much you know and i was like you know i lived in that and, and i realized that, that 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 was my identity for 20 plus years where you know if i was going to parties or doing anything if i was sad mad depressed if i just wanted to get happy if i wanted to be lazy if i you know whatever it was i felt like i had to have weed in my hand to become a habit but you know what i no longer smoke and i never want to smoke weed again and, and I was like, you know what? I'm no longer standing in that branding of my name because that is not me no more. I don't care if you was a, a whore in, in high school or even just last year, a prostitute, a drug addict, a drug dealer, a thief, a murderer, a rapist. I don't care what you was. If that's not who you are today, rebrand your name. Who cares what anyone has to say about you but you, what do you say about yourself? Can you rebrand your name? Because, you know, I'm a believer in the Lord. And, and he's given me forgiveness and grace for everything I've done, including something I did, you know, maybe 10 minutes ago. He's already forgiven me. He knew I was going to do it. He forgave me. And you know what? Like, I'm just moving forward. Continue moving forward. And I invite you today to forget who you was yesterday if you truly want change and you want to move forward and you want to become the best version of yourself you want to achieve your dreams and goals rebrand your name right here right now believe in yourself because you can do it and if you watch these videos any motivational videos inspiring videos read books i believe in you and i know you deep down inside you believe in yourself as well if you don't have anyone that believes in you right now I'm telling you, I believe in you because I've done it. I have came from deep, dark places. I came from anger. I came from loving to fight people because I was so angry, abandonment issues, all kinds of stuff. I came from that. So I know you can. And the way I know that I can was a little bit of people doing it before me. When I was having suicidal thoughts, I, I heard I just randomly saw a video on, on Facebook by Eric Thomas. He, he was living in abandoned buildings, eating out of trash cans, and he changed his life. He's the number one motivational speaker in the world. And that's what created this in me to want to help all of you because I feel your pain. I feel your hurt. And I believe in you. You can do this. So if you know someone else that needs to change their identity and they know it and you know it and you feel it and you can see it and you see more in them, please like, share, comment, tag them, send in their DM. Even if you don't want to leave a comment, on my page or share it but i see there's 73 views and one person likes it which is my mom i appreciate you greatly then just keep on being quiet and send it to them in a message to help them if you can't be that inspirational person in our life send them mine send them eric thompson send them somebody's to help change their life because that man changed my life and he doesn't even know me i love you i thank you and you know the drill be boundless i love you all have a great day